five-time European champions Barcelona, will pay their first visit to Australia to play an A-League All-Stars team in a friendly in Sydney next month, the club announced on Wednesday. The match will take place at Sydney's 80,000-seater Accor Stadium on Wednesday, the 25th of May, a few days before the A-League Men Grand Final and a few days after Barcelona wrap up their La Liga campaign at home against Villarreal. Barcelona sits second in La Liga, after an impressive resurgence under new manager and club playing great, Xavi Hernandez. He is expected to bring a full team including Dani Alves, Sergio Busquets, Frankie de Jong, Pedri and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. We are very happy to be able to announce this match in Australia today against the A-League's All-Stars. This will be the first time the team visits this country, where Barca are generating great interest, said FC Barcelona's Vice President Marketing Area Julie Guillou. Being able to play this match will give us the opportunity to bring the club and its values closer to our fans, and will also give us the opportunity for new audiences to get to know FC Barcelona and all that it represents, which has made it a reference entity on and off the pitch. Australia was a regular stop for major European clubs before the country was locked down during the COVID-19 pandemic, with the likes of Liverpool, Manchester United and Chelsea attracting big crowds for lucrative friendlies. A video of more than 95,000 fans singing You'll Never Walk Alone before an exhibition match involving Liverpool at the Melbourne Cricket Ground went viral in 2013. United and fellow English club Crystal Palace will play friendlies in Melbourne in July this year, but plans for a first Glasgow derby outside Scotland were scuppered when Rangers pulled out of the Sydney Super Cup after complaints from fans. As we emerge from our third COVID-impacted football season, Australia and the A-Leagues are once again the destination for international teams, A-Leagues chief executive Danny Townsend said. One of the world's best teams taking on the best of the A-League just days before the men's grand final is going to deliver a feast of football for fans in Australia during grand final week. The All-Stars coach and team selection process will be announced in the coming days. Due to the timing it is unlikely to feature players from either grand finalists. The All-Stars concept was introduced in 2013 for a match against Manchester United at Stadium Australia. A team was again assembled in 2014 when Juventus toured, but there has not been another since.